I would like to thank His Excellency, the former President of Nigeria, for his participation, and the Government of Rwanda and His Excellency President Kagame for hosting this event. I believe this session is not only about uh, poultry or best practices in agriculture. It's about people, about empowering communities, about generating changes by giving the people the right tools in order to grow, support the local community and contribute to the sustainable growth. I was honored to co-found the Agolum with the visionary Israeli billionaire Mr. Jacob Egel, who is known for his outstanding track record for more than four decades and his social contribution vision. Our work strategy is geared towards emerging and developing markets. Through the establishment of industrial farming communities, we enable regional food security, poverty reduction, the transfer of skills, and general socio-economic resilience, which impact directly and indirectly the communities. Importing poultry and eggs into Africa provides the population the required consumption quantities. Indeed. However, looking to reality in face, we cannot accept the well-known fact that most imported products in this field are of poor quality, without a minimal level of supervision and sometimes with expired dates. We must not accept, as friends of Africa, that such a glorious continent with so much potential will not be able to produce the food it needs within its own territory. Today, there is limited cultivation of grains and the capacities of food production plants on an industrial scale are insufficient. Meanwhile, imported animals feed makes the cultivation of crops and industrial livestock uncompetitive. We believe that the way to guarantee success is to consolidate voluntary cooperative of agricultural communities, which we call a strategic agrarian community which are agrarian household and uh, not only individual responsible for the business, but strongly benefits from the pooled infrastructure, hardware, marketing mechanism, mechanisms, which turn unprofitable agrarian business to a profitable ones. The combination of private entrepreneurship expected from the households and the pinpointed government involvement ensures the long-term viability by risk sharing. Our model, ensures that the people will have the means to thrive reasons for being protected and able to create real value for the regional and national economy. We are in a fundamental moment in Africa's history. African societies are tired of dependence on aid and a growing number of visionary African leaders are implementing all visions toward a self-sufficient continent among which, of course, His Excellency President Kagame is one of its most outstanding proponents. It is a process of becoming self-sufficient in the field of agriculture by way of modernization and industrialization. And in that, Africa cannot afford to sacrifice its rural soul. Modernization should go hand in hand with knowledge transfer to its farmers and the provision of adequate infrastructures and complementary industries so as to transform the farms into a successful business. The strategic agrarian communities is one of those proven sustainable models to enable such a vision. Thank you very much 